Number 1. Full Names These are the characters' as full names. Rachel Karen Green Joseph Francis Tribbiani Jr. Chandler Muriel Bing Ross Eustace Keller and Monica E. Geller. Her middle name is never specified. In Season 7, Phoebe says that she doesn't know her middle name, because she has never seen her birth certificate. According to the authors, the certificate got sold by her twin sister Ursula, to a Swedish runaway. Before Friends, Lisa Kudrow used to play the character of Ursula Buffay on Mad About You. That's why Friends' authors decided to give Phoebe a twin sister, in order to make a crossover between the two shows. Number 2, The Monkey In a television interview, David Schwimmer was asked who was his least favorite friend from the show, and who would he most like to see leave. After much hemming and hawing, Schwimmer replied that Marcel, Ross's pet monkey, who was a regular on the show during the first season, was his least favorite friend, and that he was glad to see him leave. Many critics agreed. Anyway, Marcel got his revenge, he has been the first one in the cast to get a role in a Hollywood film. Number 3, 9-11 Even though the Friends universe did not experience the 9-11 terrorist attack, the show expressed support for New York City in several ways. On the doodle board in Joey's apartment, there were several messages expressing support for the city and the FDNY, and several cast members wore FDNY t-shirts. The first episode filmed after 9-11 has been the one with the Halloween party, and Lisa Kudrow remembers how people would stop her in the street to say thank you, for making them laugh. Number 4, Change of Plan the original idea for the show, was going to focus on four characters, with Phoebe and Chandler in supporting roles. Before the show was cast, the main love interest was intended to be Monica and Joey, but neither seemed to have much romantic chemistry, so they were paired up with different cast members. In the early stages, the creators toyed with the idea of Chandler being gay, but they changed their minds when they met Matthew Perry. Chandler and Monica were meant to be just a one-night thing, but fans in the audience liked it so much, that they cheered the bedsheet scene for 27 seconds. The authors got the input, and made them a couple. Number 5, 6, as 1 The idea of the six lead actors and actresses negotiating as a single unit, has been credited by the rest of the main cast, as the brainchild of David Schwimmer. Ironically, Schwimmer later annoyed the other regulars, because on two occasions, the rest of the cast all agreed to sign long-term deals to continue the show. But he hesitated, and both times was the last cast regular to agree to continue. However, the decision to make season 10 the last one, was a prompt and unanimous one from all six, that was made late in season 9. Number 6, Catchphrases all of the friends have catchphrases. For Rachel, is saying the word no, in surprise. For Monica, is shouting I know, when she's excited. For Phoebe, is saying oh, no, when something bad happens. For Joey, is asking how you doing, in a flirty way. For Chandler, is emphasizing the word be, when asking a rhetorical question or emphasizing another word. And for Ross, is saying hi, in a really depressing way, when something bad has happened to him. Number 7, Ben Cole Sprouse, who would go on to great fame, starring in The Sweet Life of Zack and Cody. As well as on Riverdale. Also played Ross's son, Ben Geller, on Friends. The character made his debut in the first season as a baby. He appeared in a few episodes and then sort of vanished. Responding to a tweet asking how he felt about his character basically being killed off of the show, Cole said he wasn't too shocked about it. Critics would agree that Ross was never really the most present father, so it doesn't surprise me too much, he said. After season 8, Ben Geller never appeared in the sitcom again, never met his half-sister Emma, and was only mentioned a few times. 
Number 8, Joey and Phoebe Lisa Kudrow and Matt LeBlanc pitched a story idea in which it was revealed that Phoebe and Joey had been in a casual sexual relationship since the beginning of the series. An episode would show it by restaging the show's most memorable scenes, thus revealing that Joey and Phoebe had been intimate immediately before those scenes. The writers turned down the idea, arguing that it didn't match the tone of the show. At the same time, the producers did consider having Joey and Phoebe end up together at the end of the series. However, they abandoned this project in favor of having Joey end up single as to show that people could still have happy endings even without being in a relationship. Number 9, Famous Guests Guest stars of Friends included 12 Oscar winners Reese Witherspoon Gary Oldman Sean Penn Julia Roberts Susan Sarandon George Clooney Fisher Stevens Jim Rash Charlton Heston Helen Hunt Robin Williams and Brad Pitt Number 10, Children The storyline of Phoebe having her brother's babies was thought up when Kudrow announced her real-life pregnancy. However, as she was not big enough to be having triplets, the costumers had to pat her, to make her look bigger for the show. As you might have noticed, all three female leads were given unconventional ways of having babies. This was done on purpose. To spread social messages that surrogacy, single motherhood, and adoption, were not something to be ashamed of. Thanks for watching.